Good morning guys. Welcome to today. Today starts crazy week. I know it's Tuesday, Wednesday for you guys, but yesterday was a holiday. Today starts crazy week. Basically, everything's happening. Sam left us. He left us today to go and take our trailer in because it needs to get safety. Our trailer is up for safety. Oh my gosh, the grass is growing and now our, now our farm is turning from a junkyard into an overgrown Oh Grassier. man. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, let's head down. We have to go do the chores all ourselves. I'm uh, finding that having Sam here really gives me that extra few minutes each morning to get ready. But yeah, now we're going to go do it all ourselves. Let's go, girls. I'm making breakfast. Um, I did not expect to walk into this. Where were you? Come here. Kitty. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Hello, people. Hello, Willow. Uh, everybody thinks that we should be the head horse first, but we try. Uh-oh. And feed the most patient horses first. I don't know why. Technically, Stella is the most patient. Hold on. Get back there. Get back. Hold up. Hold up. Back it up. Back it up. There you go. Good boy. Oh, yes. Your owner, has, uh, 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 your owner has trained you so good that you would never be pushy about your grain. Right? Well, I'm sorry you're the last one. You know that most people in her life have left her to last because she is so not pushy. True. That's the way the world works though. The people who yell the loudest, scream the most, paw the ground, headbutt their stalls, they always get the most attention and it's wrong. People deserve equal attention and kind people I think deserve more. Um, Alright you guys, I'm down here. I'm going to drink my coffee still. I was worried because I was like almost about to be late to feed the horses. Before I go and do hay, I want to show you guys like these things are my life. Like somebody sent us so many of these things and literally I have a use for every single one of them. Like, these are incredible. Thank you so much. If you do not have these little things, you can't get them where we live, um, you should get them. These are so multi-purpose. It's unbelievable. But anyway, yeah, what happened, dude? Like, what happened to you? What happened to you today? That must have just happened because it looks wet. <gasps> no, it's dry. He's like, what happened to me? I'll brush you. I don't know how we're going to get that off, Hendrix. Yeah, it's all dry. You're supposed to stay in at night, dude. That's why I lock you in. Oh, my goodness. The heck? Oh. Hello. Second one to the barn. You got your breakfast and your water? This is what you got to do when there's no For dad. Riding. For riding. This is what you got to do when there's no dad to save the day. Sam might not be in every single one of our videos all the time, but he's always there working in the background and he always saves our butt. Like, he's in taking in the trailer that he bought for us to make our lives happier, easier, to give our kids more opportunities. And um, he always comes down and does our chores for us in the morning. What's happening this morning? We're having lessons. Yeah. We're having a lessons at 11 a.m., which puts a lot of pressure on us because it takes a lot of time to clean the barn. And a lot of time for Storm to eat. Mm -hmm. I want to do one of those 50 things you didn't know about me. Oh, no. Because there's a lot of things you guys don't know about me. Like this Laura that you guys know is so different than the Laura I used to be. And so different like than in the Laura in my head. One thing is that I hate when people come to my house and it's not clean. And doesn't look nice. And uh, yeah, losing battle. But it's teaching me to not care. But still, I still care. So having our instructor arrive when we're not prepared not my funnest thing. It's Gabby's turn to do hay. Wait, I don't like the pinning of the ears. You don't like the pinning of your ears, Mr. Superstar? So most people thought that you guys tied in yesterday's jumping competition. Some people thought that you won due to bravery and how far you've come. Other people thought Gabby should win based on a uh, skill and 
kindness and helping your competitor that See, people thought no, that. I win. Yeah, I'm, I win. in my heart, you both win because you both took totally different roles. Okay, we're and we're in total. Beach. <laughs> it was not a, a paying competition, but I'll make you a ribbon when we go home. Okay, make it. All right. Now. Right now, I get make it. She gets no, I get champion, she gets reserved. Okay. No, I want champion. Do you think that you jumped better than Gabby? Well, no, but I jumped. You jumped, and that was amazing. You are a winner in yourself. You know, it's not my winning. Come on, let's go. Hey, did you guys notice brushed hair, brushed hair all around? This is why you need to lead them. You forgot Storm's bell boots. Yeah. Come on now. Come on. Good. Follow Gap. I think they're not muddy road. That's Good fine. Good boy. Hey, get them away from their hay. Clearly we need more practice because uh, Sam doesn't put the mare food out until the geldings are out and that way they don't try and stop and eat it. Eat it. <laughs> Ooh, that's a hay. We need to put her in work. Don't you? Yeah. We do need to put her in work. All right, let's put the girls into work. Let's go. Clean your stalls, okay, ladies. Okay, Every day I make a tiny new goal for myself because sometimes when you have a job that is so crazy, overwhelming, the only way to get through it is to set a small goal each day. And today, I plan to get the backyard where the chickens are cleaned up of all the rocks and sticks and stuff from the tree being cut down so that I can cut the grass and our yard looks a little better. Tomorrow, I plan not to get a cut. Yeah, poor Sophie got a cut. I was so worried. I was like, oh no, I hope you can still have your lesson. And what were you like? I can still have my lesson. Yeah. Yeah. I literally feel like I lived a life. I lived the whole day already before breakfast time. Oh, I love a clean barn. I love my family being down here. We just had lunch and uh, look what I did to the arena. Oh, you can't really tell, but I like raked it all and made it nice. We actually have a... Um, a machine thing like a metal thing that will grade the arena and we can attach it to our lawn tractor that I can drive so now my beautiful barn is about to get messy and that's okay Finn your tail here comes music girl did you have coffee today no no I dropped my leader though yay hey Stella hello Yes, today I'm gonna to groom you and make you beautiful. And Willow. The girls are getting ready uh, for their lesson, like they're just starting to tack up. I told them from now on, I want them to tack up in the cross side because the horses need that. And they're always tacking them up in the arena, tying them in a safety knot, which is a knot that comes untied, in the arena, then walking through the barn to get all their tacks. So I'm like, either get all your tack or 
do them in here. So that's what they're gonna do. But anyway, yesterday when, Sam's always behind the scenes working, you guys. Yesterday, when we were inside, he was creating a new outside arena for us. So uh, I haven't gone to see it yet, so I'm gonna go check it out. You're a rebel, getting into trouble. You are kinda like a fire, like a fire, like a fire. Unpredictable, so original. You are never backing down, backing down, backing down. That's what I like about you. I like it. I love it. I actually, uh, it's small, kinda, but I love it. I think it's pretty, pretty, uh, flat. Uh, I think that the girls are going to ride inside until the weather dries up a bit more too. So dangerous. I get this rush. It's nice. Get working. 40. I mean, well, she just asked. I'm going to get my boots on. So you have 20 minutes till you should be, you should have 15 you minutes. I got it down here. I like 10.20. No excuses. No excuses. Get ready. Our trainer is here. Today is our lesson with race car driver. I like to call him that because Fiona is like our, our comfort and our foundation and our support and our skill driving and our strictness, even though people don't believe that. And race car driver is our cherry on top. He also was our skill. And he, but he drives us and he pushes us a little further and he kind of lets us do more that we shouldn't be doing. <laughs> but it's in a, in a good way, in a safe way because he has all the skills. But yeah, like we have such a good combination of trainers. Guys, give the boys more water. Dad did. Oh good, did he dump yeah, it? Did. Oh good, look at you, Willow. You guys are shedding this girl down. So we're gonna work her a bit. Yeah, <laughs> that's so satisfying though. Like it's still, kind of chilly right. out, so it hasn't been super important to get her uh, shed it out. But when she collared, yes. Yeah, but now she's really shedding out. She's looking good. So the vet's gonna be here in two more days. Hey, hey, no she. Look at the, look at the dust. Yeah. She looks good though. Gabby, you gotta do this side too. So I have this side, that's gonna I know, but look at, so look at the difference between shedding blade and other shedder. I don't know if you guys can see it in the camera. Big difference. Ooh. I know, but now look at Gabby's. Ooh. A lot. Stella's like, what are you doing to my baby? Hi. What do you think? Oh, did you roll? Do you want to have a grooming session? You've been looking kind of ragged. You've been looking kind of ragged, Stella. Unpredictable. So original, you were never backing down, backing down, backing down. That's what I like about you. So dangerous, I get this rush. I just shot a video, hopefully it'll be up on our channel soon. I shot it, like me, by myself, doing my own horse thing. Um, anyways, uh, I finally got a chance to use the tripod that I bought at a yard sale on the weekend, so that was a good buy. I want to show you a little Miss Willow. She's sporting all this fancy braids and she looks like a glider. She's me. been groomed and she's lost a lot more of her. She shed it out a lot. Did you did you do her feet? Uh, her toes are looking a little bit pointy, and that's because the farrier is coming in two days. Like when I started running with her. I kissed and she went into the canter and then she started galloping with her ears forward and I'm like, we don't need whips. I go all in to lose or win. Building something to knock them down. It's the way we keep our high moving like a hurricane. There will come a time for when we can wash away your sins. Settle down, but until then, we're like a Amazing, like holy cow. So, uh, flowers are a big thing for me, and we have a little garden. And um, Sophie wants to plant flowers, she's really into it, so we're getting her some pink. Geraniums. I love geraniums. I like those a lot. Right on the yeah, they're. Oh, I like that. Our 
I like the square ones. This is what I need to get. That's nice. So I can have a relax while these guys are riding their horses. Okay. Yeah, that'd be good in our little nook in our barn. Yeah. If it would fit, imagine. No, because this is the outside. You guys be riding your horses, I'll be. Yeah, uh, down by where we're going to put the arena would be great. It's cute. I love that. Isn't that adorable? I told you earlier that Sam took the trailer in to get uh, to get safety. And basically, uh, if you guys have been following us for a while, you know that we bought a trailer last year that was... Sam bought a trailer last year and he took it in to get safety and they said uh, this is a lemon it, it will cost us twenty thousand dollars to safety this trailer so Sam said all right and he took it to the junkyard and got rid of it and bought our other trailer and so it was already certified it was already safety so we didn't have to do anything until now it's coming up in June that we have to have it safety again and Sam took it there today and we were like oh gosh like anything could happen we could have lost our trailer um, if it was too much to fix and he took it and they just called us and all it needed was a new battery so that is super amazing like that is a lucky trailer and don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below